Now let's start our second solution method for Langley's problem. First, we can easily calculate this angle to be 50 degrees. Now let's call this angle as A. Then our missing angle will be 110 minus A. Now let's apply sine theorem on triangle DBC to get BD over BC equals sine 80 over sine 40. For the next step, apply sine theorem on triangle BDE to get BD over EB equals sine 50 plus A over sine 110 minus A. We know that EB is equal to BC from the 50 degree base angles of isosceles triangle EBC. So we can equate right side of the equations as follows. And instead of sine 80 term, we can write 2 times sine 40 times cosine 40. Now we can simplify sine 40 terms. And let's cross multiply to get the following equation. Now let's use this trigonometric identity on the right side of the equation. So right side of the equation will be in this form. Instead of sine 150 minus a, we can write sine 30 plus a. And move sine 70 minus a term to other side of the equation also using this property. Using the same trigonometric identity, left side can be rewritten as follows. From here, cosine 60 and 2 will cancel out. Now we have this final equation to solve. Using the property on the right side, we can write as follows. From here, we can say that 190 minus a equals 30 plus a. And so a will be 80 degrees. Since we are looking for 110 minus a, the answer will be 30 degrees. Don't forget to check this playlist for alternative solutions of this problem. I'll see you next time.